Hey, this is Full Game Prometheus giving you another Full Game recap. Um, I'm going to be rolling with a different playbook. This is going to be a Patreon request. Uh, it is Panthers playbook on offense and defense. Uh, jumped into a different team, uh, which is Chicago Bears. Haven't played with them for quite a long time. Uh, but uh, this is going to be a team that, that I'm going to be using and going against the Chiefs. So uh, that's going to be uh, one of those tough situations. So came out of the trips uh, formation, uh, and the halfback pump draw is one of the base one of the base run plays I like to really use a lot. Right here, I get away with one. That was really, really lucky. There was a coverage in, the, in that area, and I actually threw right over a defensive back and was able to get away with it and come back around and actually get really good animation on the back end side. So I'm going to be abusing this slot. Uh, corner, uh, halfback, uh, angle type play. And right here I'm able to get the ball down to the 23-yard line. So I was run actually running some, uh, having some issues because it was a brand new playbook and um, I actually took a delay of game, checked it down to the little drag route right here on the corner play and able to get the ball up to the 20. So second and seven situation right here and I throw right into his defender and he does not get the animation to get an interception. That was just another bad play. I got away with one and actually try to squeeze another ball right in there and settle for the three points. So you're going to see like uh, in this type of situation where I got away with a couple of animations and watch this right here. This guy was running basically spread. No running backs in the backfield. Basically spread me out. Um, I'm actually going with my, my safety blitz right here. Throws into three defenders but no one comes down with the ball but his wide receiver and he catches it. And of course, he no huddles, and um, I was so frustrated with that. I even I didn't set up my seam defenders correctly. I actually put him in seam flat, so that actually opened up the, the 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 seams, and he pops the ball right down to the two yard line right there. No huddles again. Brings the ball uh, down there. I scrunch up the line, assuming they'll try to run the ball, try to hit the gap, but I have a defender actually block sheds for me and gets it down to the, uh, the one yard line. But he's able to go and punch it in with a QB uh, play right there. So. Going back to the, the, the draw right now, down uh, four points. Uh, you can pick up a good four yards right here. A little crosser. Actually, no. This is the theme of the game is, on offense is actually my quarterback was completely overthrowing balls. So right here you can see uh, the ball just throws, just gets, just sails on me. And um, unfortunately my running back comes down with it. So I'm anticipating some type of uh, cover two shell, but that isn't correct. Right here he's got me pretty much locked up, so I'm just going to go take off quarterback. I rarely run with my quarterback, but they had to do that. I'll, I'll, pick, I'll take the five yards just to go again and get shorter down distance. Try to go and hit them, hit him with a slip screen, um, but his defender comes in before I can get rid of the ball. I just didn't read it correctly, but I hit him right down in the middle of the seam right there to go ahead and get convert a 13 and 7 situation. Back to the pump draw granite right there. Get a nice little uh, animation. Try to spin move, uh, but I get a first down, so I'll take it. Uh, right now, um, I'm throwing off to the right. Look at this. This is a comeback route, and his defender was right there, but does not make a play. I think he clicked on, and if he if let the CPU play that, I, he probably would have got an interception. So, um, right here, the defender actually comes up and actually yeah, gets me in the backfield against that, that pump drop. I drop it down into the uh, into the flat with the running back and try to take another shot right over the seam and the ball sails on me. So that was like three bad passes already. I had one reception out of three bad passes, but we go in the half down uh, by one, and I'm giving the ball back to, to, to uh, this guy. So he's able to go and pop me right in the middle of the field, um, and I switch into uh, just a kind of a blitzing formation, which is covered to shell. He actually checks down, actually hits Tariq Hill uh, off the flat. No huddles, no huddles, no huddles. Not playing against no huddles or uh, huddles is just so annoying. It's just uh, people that, that that quick hike and quick snap is just an annoying thing, especially if they, they do understand what they're doing. So this guy gets the ball down to uh, the red zone. I switch it up to cover two because all my other shells are not working against this guy. So I, I've got a spy because the way he likes to slide out of the pocket. And right now the cover two completely locks him up. He doesn't know what to read. So I send the spy after him and I sack him. So of course... You know, huddles again. I go into the cover two shell with the spy. I'm going to go ahead and use this guy. He's got this uh, this uh, basically empty set. Got the spy, and I get nice little edge pressure with Cleo Mack uh, to get it past his tackle, and it works out for me. So once again, I spread my guys out. Got a spy. A third and 25 type situation. He's got like a bunch set. Uh, and right here, he takes off. I send my spy, and I'm able to go and sack him again. So... 
Fourth and 28. I don't know why this guy is going for it. Um, I would be more likely to go for the three points. It's stupid. But he actually throws right into my defensive back in the flat, uh, Callahan, and I'm able to go ahead and get the ball right down to uh, the 47-yard line to get the ball back. So I'm, I'm in a pretty good situation. So I hit him with a little draw play. Uh, his defenders come off the uh, come uh, come off and actually attack my flat. Look to a crossing right over the middle. Uh, come back uh, to a play where I'm actually trying to hit the t tight end, but the ball sails on me, and I think it's just because there was a defender in the area, so actually it wasn't not that bad of a play. Try to hit a cor corner uh, comeback route, but that doesn't happen for me. And right here, I've got a little crossing route. Once ball, this ball sails on me again. Actually, it's probably not a bad situation because I'd be throwing into a defender. And then on the back side, I actually do uh, a post route, and I'm able to come down with it because he manned people up uh, on a fourth down. So right here, uh, come back to the draw play right now, uh, get a good nine-yard uh, nine play, and then do a little uh, outside uh, run, uh, a stretch play, and I'm able to go and get the ball in the end zone. So up. And I try to go uh, for a two-point conversion, but once in a while, the ball sails on me again. It was just I was just really struggling to keep uh, Mitch Trubisky to keep the ball in the, in the field. So... Back to cover two again. This is where he was having some situations. But you see, he redirected his guy against the cover two shell uh, and actually had made a phenomenal play. So he comes back to the same concept, but on the opposite side, redirects the guy. But this time, my defensive back, Callahan, is actually in the area to go ahead and intercept the ball. So I'm feeling pretty good about this situation. So I'm up by a score. I've got the ball. And right now, yeah, I'm just going to chew this clock up against this guy. So... Come back to the comeback route uh, uh, earlier and actually hit that. Nice little draw play once again to pick up a good nine yards. So we're just chewing up the clock. Looking to the flat. Nobody calls off the flat, so I'm going to go check it down. Try a spin move, but his defender just sucks me up and tackles me. Then come back to the draw play again. Look at the blocking on this. I actually pick up a good 11 yards right there with on, on that draw play. Now just do a nice inside zone uh, because he's actually scrunched up his lineup and he's, he has to really start defending that run. So the zone actually come uh, once again, put me a third in one situation and actually take a delay of game because I'm trying to set up a play. And right here, I actually tried to hit the out rod. It was open, but uh, the ball was misthrown. So I was struggling with, with just very bad passes. So right here, I go ahead and take my, my, my tight end, streak him up, and I've got a backside uh, route, which is going to be an in route. And I want to go with a high percentage receiver. So I throw it to Robinson, he actually comes down with it. So that's pretty much game right here. I'm just going to keep checking it down and just running the ball, running the clock out as much as possible. Uh, he's actually burning his timeouts. Right here, I get the, the ball down to a third and one type of situation. And he actually gets really good penetration. But I'm going to be able to go and chew that clock down about 14 seconds left. Put him in a situation where he has to score a touchdown and get a, a two-point conversion. So I'm going to go and settle for three points right here. And this is pretty much the rest of the game because, uh, you know, I'm going to man up his guys and he's, he's I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to basically QB contain. There's really not much you can do after this uh, in this type of situation. You know, with, with two plays left, you really can't do much. Right there is just a bad play. Uh, right here, he just comes back to this. And I think he actually completes a wide receiver, but without any time, it's just, you, just nothing you can do. So once again, my subscribers, thank you for your support. And to my patrons, really, I, I really appreciate your, your support, guys. I'll be rolling out some more gameplay. I've got some um, some new patrons that are actually going to be uh, pushing for new playbooks. So I'll be going ahead and, and building out some new playbooks and showing some gameplay. So thanks, thanks again for your, for your time. Until next time.